राज चक्रवर्ती प्लीज इंट्रोड्यूस योर सेल्फ चक्रवर्ती बोली हु इज राज चक्रवर्ती प्लीज इंट्रोड्यूस योर सेल्फ अदरवाइज आई हैव टू रिमूव यू गुड मॉर्निंग सर गुड मॉर्निंग राज चक्रवर्ती प्लीज रिप्रेजेंट योर सेल्फ आई हैव नो आईडिया हु आर यू I can see, but it's absolutely dark. Can you just introduce yourself? Raj, so, can you say something about yourself? I can't see you. It's absolutely dark. Raj, please introduce yourself. Say something. Otherwise, I have to remove you. I don't know who are you. Are you a new admit? Raj, do you belong to class seven or class eight? If you belong to class eight, please introduce yourself, Raj Chakraborty. Otherwise, I have to remove you. Okay, I can see all of you are here. Class eight, Orijit, Farha, Nosin, Tasnim. Okay, the single person. Uh, Rupanjan is there. Sagnik, Saki, Baradhya. Okay, I'm still waiting for two or three. Acha Sagnik, do you have the textbook right in front of you? Okay, chapter uh, two is left out, isn't it? Microorganisms. Microorganisms. Yeah, that. that we are yes, going sir. to do tomorrow that we are going to do tomorrow we have done first chapter isn't it we have talked about irrigation fertilization eutrophication you remember i yes, did the notes for production and management okay very good we also did metals and non metals we did friction as well yes sir okay yes uh, sir to, today also force and friction be, yeah 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 today Force and pressure okay 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 i will be uh, you know uh, discussing some basic questions about these two chapters force friction and the other one is something like uh, this food and tomorrow we are going to do uh, microorganisms okay i will wait for one or two more minutes and then i'll start and then i'll start okay sir uh, i am asking this question to all of you class 8 students so do you know this person raj chakraborty he is absolutely new to me no sir No sir. No sir. Okay, okay. Okay. okay, okay, okay. Thank you because I am new to your school, and in fact, I am now getting used to all of you. Saklin is here. Sakib has joined. Uh, Abu Shahid was yesterday, but today I can't see him. Hello, sir. Good morning. Good morning. Hello, sir. Good morning. Good morning, Saklin. Yes, sir. Saklin, how many rosas you have kept? Four or five? Well, four. Four. I will no, show all the rest. I only, I only, I only take only two, not all. Okay, okay. Now, Sain, how are you? Yeah, we're fine. Okay. And when is the Eid? Tentative date of Eid will be on twenty fourth. I have no idea. Please rectify me if I'm wrong. No, sir. From Rosa, thirty days. 
first Rosa. is from Rosa. Okay, okay. So this is the month of yes. Ramzan going on, right? Yes, sir. Okay, okay. Uh, the time is uh, five past eleven, and I hope now no other one is going to come. Where is Suja, by the way? Suja is not here. I'm not came yet. Not came uh, yet. Ara, Nausin, Sajid, Saklin, Arijit, Rupanjan, Aradhya, Sakib. Ah. Babu Shahid, Afisa, Sujoy. These three are left. Okay, let us start. Let us start and I'm sharing the screen with you. Yes, sir. Okay. Today is 29th of April. First question. Today I will be asking questions from two chapters. One crops and the other one uh, pressure. Okay. Uh, question okay. number one. Origit, I am giving you the first chance today to answer. Okay. Uh, mention, mention three uses of now friction friction please wait till the question is complete you can exemplify to express your answers that means you can give examples to express your answers origit take one minute preparation time the moment I'll tell you Origit speak, then only say, okay? If you can't, I will ask Shadnik to answer. Shadnik, be ready. Sir, but I hope sir you can explain, express you, you answer. Uh, you can exemplify to express your answers. Means you can give examples, sir. Because of this, we need friction. Okay, I'll give you one or two minutes preparation time, and then I'll ask you. Get yourself uh, ready. You are completed. So, Arijit, yes. get ready to answer and here you are. Okay, start. The, the three uses of friction are uh, okay. is, is change the shape of an object. Example, I'll, press, I, I, pressing you, a ball. Wait, 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 wait. Just uh, what you are telling that your first answer is to change the shape, right? Yes, sir. To change the shape. Okay, I'll give you that. Uh, that's your answer. Uh, number two. To bring a moving body to rest. To bring a moving body to rest. I'm writing, Origit. Please take, it, take a note of it. To bring a moving body to rest. Body to rest. Next. To make our body at rest move. To make a uh, body at rest. I hope you can understand my horrible handwriting. Rest move. Yes, sir. Okay, that means you agree my handwriting is horrible. Thank you. Anyway, is there anyone who would like to challenge Origit? I hope there has to be one or two. Is there anyone who would like to challenge Origit? Sagnik, like to challenge Origit? How can I challenge? How can you challenge it? Please don't fight with him. Okay. Uh, Origit, no, thank you for your answer. Shagni, would you like to say something? Uh, one, of the, one of the uses. Uh, no, just the uh, what answers Origit gave. Do you agree with him? Sir, the number two and number three are the same only. To bring a moving body at to rest, make a body. Yes. So these are two. These are opposite. Number two is he has to make a uh, moving body to rest. It will stop. It will stop. And number three, it will move. So there is a difference. But in other way, do you agree with origin? Yes. yes okay. Sir. Anyone else with a different opinion? Anyone else? With sir, I say. Yeah, please. 
that to make a stationary body move see actually that means body at rest to make a stationary body move means that means the body is at rest so if you apply something it will move so none of you are uh, willing to express anything right so first and the foremost thing orijit and sadik thanks to both of you to participate but i am sorry to say both of you will get a big rasgulla here question is what you have told is the effect of force and my question was friction did you read the question properly please please participate sadik and orijit both of you were very eager to say thank you for your participation i appreciate you but did you read the question the question was friction not force why are you answering in a different way my dear friends please make a note of a question now sagnik i want answer from you tell me the uses of friction please read the question then you say that is why already i told you i'm giving you time to prepare see the friction yes please go ahead you can share the notes not an issue but please read the question hello sir yeah 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 sagnik i can hear you sagnik can you hear me sir Sagnik, sir i can me? tell no please wait <laughs> let sagnik say sagnik can you hear me sir i can say wait wait let him say i will give chance to everyone this is an interaction not an issue sagnik are you there yes sir i am there okay can you tell me the answer or should i switch to orijit sir please is a friction mm -hmm. which one hello sir yeah tell me hello sir sagnik i can hear you um friction can be used for for applying brakes when applying brakes very good very good very good sabni go ahead next point origin be ready next hmm. point yes the head of friction we so number 1 for the application of brakes i'll give you that brakes what's number 2 Alter. Hmm. Okay. Friction can be used uh, with the help of friction. We can write with pen. Well, you can write with a pen. Okay, writing. I'll give you that. Now, Sagnik, I am switching over to Rupanjan. Rupanjan, like to say the third point. Yes, sir. Yes, oh, wait, sir. Wait, Origi, wait. Uh, Rupanjan, say the third point. Okay. Sir, rubbing both hands. Uh -huh. Okay, I'll give you that. Rubbing both hands. Okay, rubbing hands. But can you give me a simple example? Rubbing hands is not a regular feature. We don't do that unless we feel cold. Hmm? Sir, Sir, walking on the road. Uh, walking on the road is a good example. Okay, Orijit, are you here? Yes, sir. Thank you for your participation. Your question, everyone, please uh, take part and let Orijit say. Tell me the disadvantages of friction. Friction make a hard, slight, heavier object. Orijit. Friction makes My, wait, it wait, wait, wait. hard Orijit, to Orijit. slide a heavier object. Orijit, Orijit, just let me tell you one thing. Read the question, understand the question, take your time to answer. Okay, you are not in a mood to you know board a plane or a train because in India neither you can have plane or a train. Okay, so take your time and answer. My question is, what are the disadvantages of friction? Refer to my notes. I already gave it to you. All of you open the notes, see, and then Orijit answer. I'll give you one minute time because. The previous time you were asked to answer, you gave a wrong answer. Please take time and then answer. Come on. Sir, I will tell now. Yeah, tell. Sir, noise is produced in machines and engines. Okay, I'll give you that. Very good. Next. The friction causes hair and tear in a machine. 
Can you spell it? Sir, what? Explain. It should, yeah, it should be wear and tear. W A E A R, wear and tear. Right. And tear. Yeah. Wear and tear in a machine. Very good. And friction develops a heat. Not only that, it produces. Yes, sound. sir. Generate heat. Yeah. Friction okay. generate heat. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you, Arjun. You for can. Answering. Sir, when we, we can, sir, when we can rubbing our palm, we, we. I'll tell you, we are not habituated to rub our hands. Are we habituated? Is this a regular habit? No. no. Only when we yes, feel sir. too much of cold, we can rub our hand. Am I correct? Yes. So naturally, sir. in this case, I'm not interested uh, to say something like rubbing your hand. Can I move to the next page? Sir. All of you? Sir. Yes, sir. sir. Causes causes damage of tires and of vehicles. Okay, well, causing damage is very much equal to wear and tear. See, I'm writing beside wear and tear equal to damage. Got it? Sir, we will write this. Yeah. Then why am I? What I'm writing for? I'm going to the next page. Yes, sir. No, sir. No, sir. Wait, wait for some time. I'm not writing. Hurry, hurry up. I'll give you one minute. Yes, sir. I want to finish. Okay, okay. Rubbing is very good. One. Rubbing hands and walking. Disadvantage. And heat. Sound. Well, yes, sir. Sir, complete. Sir, my work is complete. Thank you. I'm going to the next page. Yes, sir. Sujoy is here. Sujoy has joined. Only two persons I can't see. One is Afisa and the other one is Nazmus. Anyway, I hope they will join later. Okay. Question number two. Number two. Find the weight of a body in Newton whose Mass is ninety thousand grams. Do it. You can take G to be ten uh, meter per second square. Understand the question before answering. Sir, mass is 9,000. Mass is 90,000 grams. And I want it in Newton. One Newton is equal to 151 meter.
Are you people done with the answer? Arijit, what is the answer? Sir, I am doing. Okay, Shagni. Shujoy, what is the answer? I am trying to do. I'm okay, trying okay. to do. Shujoy, what is the answer? Sir, doing. Okay. Where is Abu Shahid gone? He was here. So one Newton is equal to? Ten to the power five. Dines. One, one gives him to one meter per second square. Hmm. What? Please do not discuss, do it by yourself. One semi square. The answer is 9D. Let us see. I am doing on the board. Okay, let us see. Not an issue. I am doing. Can you see the board? Yes, sir. This is the answer. No, see, I am doing stepwise. Are you all getting the answer which I am doing on the board? Please check it. I have done entire details for the problem. Are you getting 900 instead of 90? Someone told 90. Yes, sir, I got 90. Please check it. Hey, Origin, just I am asking, Abu was here, where is he? Don't know, sir. He is there. He was but here. Abu too. gone, Sakib came. Yeah, yes, sir. Abu. What happened, I know, don't know. Oh, Abu what? is there. Not, now Abu is not there. But Sakib okay. is there. Sakib is a good boy. Sakib, how are you? Sakib is muted. Sakib, how are you? Saki, become unmute. <laughs> anyway, did you get the answer that I have drawn? M into what you let A. M into A. Acceleration due to gravity. Yes, sir. Finished storage is copying? Yes, sir. Can I go to the next page? All of you? Yes, yes sir. sir. Yes, yes sir. sir. Oh, there was yes, uh, Sakib. Sakib, how are you? Yes, sir. Yes, fine. Sir. Okay, I asked you a question. You are answering me so late. Anyway, no, not an issue. Next page. Question number three. Find the pressure of a liquid column. whose area is 
258 meter square comma height height 80 centimeter g equals to 980 centimeter square and the liquid density is 13.6 gram per centimeter cube all the best hurry up all of you if all of you are ready then i may ask any person to dictate me and i write on his behalf on the board Waiting to be in the G. Sir, what do you mean? Height? Height is 80. 80 centimeter. Height of the liquid column. This is so how density it is what? Density is 13.6 gram per centimeter cube. See, I am drawing the liquid column for you. Please do not laugh at my horrible diagram. This is the area 258 meters square. Okay, this is the height of the liquid column which is 80 centimeter. We are having G to be 980 centimeter per second square. I have written wrong unit, please rectify it. Centimeter per second square. And then density of liquid DL is 13.6 gram per centimeter cube. Who can do this? Sir, Answer yeah. is one zero zero one zero six six two four zero. Wait, this is Orijit, right? So Orijit says, please tell me your answer. One zero. One zero. Uh -huh. Six One zero six six. One zero six six two four zero. Two four zero. Can you tell me the unit? Sir, unit is centimeter. Centimeter is something like, you know, the height. What is the unit of pressure I told you the other day? I gave you the note about the unit of pressure the other day. Check it and tell me the unit. What is the unit of pressure in CGS system? Sabnik, are you there? Yes, sir. Please check the notes and tell me what is the unit of pressure in CGS system. In SI system, it is called Pascal, I told you. But what is in CGS system? Uh, dine. CGS system? Yeah. Dine, dine. Dyne is actually a unit of force, but uh, see to it, see to it. Is it Pascal or one Pascal equal to one Newton? Is a unit is a proper Pascal. Okay, read it out what I gave you. I will give you Dyne, read it out. Now let me tell you one thing. In case you forget the unit, there can be a case where you can forget the unit at the time of the exam, right? So what will you do? This is a trick I should say that in case the answer oh, is, yeah, say origin, the answer is 1066240, okay? And you have forgotten the yes. unit of, you have forgotten the Seven. unit. Yeah, tell me. So, uh, the one is, uh, it didn't. 
under the g line is a little plus for this one okay this is actually i have done a calculation how to take out the unit because the formula of pressure is h into d into g so if you really d. put on put on h to be centimeter okay then you are putting density to be gram divided by centimeter cube and g is so what you written s a square yeah s square i am just telling you the units which i am writing see h will be represented by centimeter d is represented by grams per centimeter cube and g centimeter per second square so if you go on cancelling if you go on cancelling we are having 2 cm above and 1 cm below so this is what remains isn't it g as the numerator cm second square as the denominator so it can be gram per cm second square or you can say here after so what you written where 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 are you talking origin cm so is g on the e G below that centimeter cube, centimeter cube, three, three. Yeah. Okay, Now, sir. Please uh, listen, everyone. Orijit, this is your answer one zero double six two four zero, right? But when I yes, am asking sir. you the unit, you are actually getting confused, sir. What to write in the unit? So it is better to write here CGS unit. I'll give you marks. CGS unit. If you are telling this also, I'll give you marks. Shagrik, is your answer coming? Yeah. Okay. What is the value you have got? So, which one you are talking about? Uh, the value of pressure. The question was find the pressure of a liquid column. So, what is your answer? If I am asking you the answer, what oh, is the answer? Oh, that's not done. Oh, that's not done. That's not done. Why? Right. Come on, do it. Okay. Can I move to that the next? That one doing. Okay. Can I move to the next no, page, sir. all of you? Can I move to the next page? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Thank yes. you. Yes, sir. Let us see what you. Orijit, tell me what you did. And Sagdik and the others, please listen. Orijit, tell me what you did. Sir, so, I have multiply eighty. Wait, wait. First, you tell me the formula. First, you tell me the formula. First, you tell me the formula. Is that P is equal to H into D into G? Okay. So now, what you are putting? Sir, eight. Ma'am, sir, eighty. Eighty. Then. Sir, D is thirteen point six. Okay, multiply then, method then then the g is 980 okay so 80 Centimeter. into 13.6 into 980 put a zero here and cancel this so you are having yes, 8 sir. into 136 into 980 yes sir okay so can you tell me the value you told me the previous page shadnik are you getting the same value Yes, sir. I'm getting two. Yes, yes, yes. Telling one word. Telling. Okay. Same word. So can I can I just move to the next sum because this sum I hope you people have understood. What, sir? This sum I hope you people have understood. Can I go to the next page? I mean next sum. Yes, sir. Sir, yes, sir. you can go to the. Yes, sir. Unit is. Unit CGS is as I told you. CGS unit. This you need to write. Okay. Orijit, this question is for you, specifically for you. Okay. Name the three elements. A fertilizer must contain. Can you see the board? Name the three elements a fertilizer must contain. T. 
What what are the three elements a fertilizer must contain? Arijit, are you there? I hope he moved out. Sagni, tell me the answer. Um, the three elements that fertilizer must contain are nitrogen, phosphorus, okay. and okay. Um, organic matter. Nitrogen, nitrogen, phosphorus. What is the third one? Who can tell me the third one? Sir, I will say. Yeah, please. The potassium. Very good. Potassium. So, ammonia? No. Okay, now I will teach you something that how to find out. Sir. Yeah, yeah, you went out, no? How to find out the percentage. Yes, sir, can you tell the question on time? Yeah, I please can't see the, see the screen. Okay, okay, okay. Name the three elements. I of can't see the board. Okay, okay, okay. Origit, take it down. Origit, take it down. I am repeating. Name the three elements a fertilizer must contain. How to find out the percentage of an element? Children, are you listening? Yes, sir. Okay. Shagni, are you there? Yes, sir. Say the percentage of say the percentage of nitrogen in NH4 so uh, Okay, you have to calculate. So step number one. Step one. Find the molecular mass hurry up guys because time is running out nh4 no3 is how much 14 plus 4 into 1 4 again 14 plus 3 into 16 is 48 how much will that be 80 Yes, sir. Wait for I writing. How to find find percentage of element? Answer. Say. Say the percentage of nitrogen. Okay, you have to find out. Find out. So follow the steps. Step number one, you have to find out the mass. Step number two, use the formula. Total mass of element divided by... So what do you think? Find the molecular mass. Yeah, I have done on the board as well. Yes, sir. Divided by molecular mass into 100. Find the molecular mass. 14 plus 4 plus 14 plus 48. 80. We have got less than a minute left. The meeting will end abruptly. Then 28 by 80 into 100. I am taking queen shot. So you are complete? Yes, Abu Shahid has queen come back. Shot. Thanks for him.
the meeting will end within a few minutes have you all copied yes sir, yes, sir. Yes, sir.